This is a new tool for removing blood clots. It was invented partly by accident, and it works by wringing the red blood cells out of a clot and leaving a dense bundle of fibrous protein that can be easily removed. The scientists who designed it call it the millispinner, and they think it could be a safer and more effective way of surgically clearing dangerous blood clots from the lungs or brain. This is what the millispinner looks like in a pig kidney. It's a tiny device on the end of a long catheter that winds its way through the blood vessels until it reaches a blockage. Currently, a standard surgical method would be to use a catheter like this to simply suck up a clot. But when you've got a big clot and a small catheter, this often doesn't work. The team behind the millispinner started out trying to do the same thing, use suction to physically pull out chunks of clot. But the spinning motion that they were experimenting with had another unexpected impact. As well as suction, it also created shear forces. Imagine a loose ball of cotton wool. As you roll it in your hands, it gets smaller and more compact. Something similar happens in the clot. The red blood cells get squeezed out, leaving just a small, dense ball of fibrin. This is what the clot starts off looking like under a microscope, full of red blood cells. And here, afterwards, you can see the protein strands that are left. The team say this is a more effective way of getting rid of clots, particularly in cases like stroke, where a blood clot blocks a vessel in the brain and where other methods could cause bits of clot to break off and end up somewhere else. So far, they've tested it in plastic tubes like these and in pig organs, but the hope is that this new technology will be undergoing human trials in the next few years.